Jesus name Amen The Lord of choosing in Jesus name Thank you thank you Thank you As Pastor Sam have said I have been a member of this family Whether there is a program here in Lagos in Mbidi, I have been one that everybody knows. I've been very close to Pastor. I have remained consistent that every program I'm there. Today, today I'm here asking you for three things. You know next year we are going to election. Put Nigeria in prayers. Put Nigeria in prayers. I'm not here for campaign. I'm here to ask for prayers for our country, Nigeria. Put it in Nigeria that everywhere in the world the purpose of government is to care for the poor. Everywhere in the world, the purpose of government is to care for the poor. In Nigeria, the purpose of government is to make the poor suffer. And that is why I want you to pray that next year, let God, let God not allow us again to choose somebody or anybody or group of people that will continue to bring suffering in this country again. May God Almighty, may God Almighty never allow it again. Do not vote for anybody because it's from your area or because it's of religion. Please, nobody, no religion buys bread cheaper. No tribe buys religion bread cheaper. That is what politicians are using to manipulate us. And don't vote for any Peter or anybody because it is torn. It is the turn of Nigerians to take back their country. Nigeria is a great country. It is we, the leaders, that made it that people are suffering. And this suffering must stop. We want government that will make people to earn a living. Government that will give a youth job. Government where a son of nobody, a daughter of nobody, will be somebody. And it will happen in this country. So I urge you, please, remain prayerful. Ask questions about those you want to vote for. Ask your background. It is important. As you pray, participate in the election. Don't leave it the way it used to be. We want this country to work. We want this country to work. I'm praying as well. And I'm praying and asking God do not allow this situation to continue. I assure you, we have no other country. All I can assure you is that for next year, God will take control of this country. And you will see it. And I'm sure G.O. and the pastors are all praying. This is a great country. He has no reason to be poor. We have no reason to be hungry. So hunger must cease in this country. Poverty must cease in this country. And we will start by electing a good leader. Thank you and God bless all of you. <laughs>